The dream of an unprecedented double treble is no more. Manchester City's hold on the Champions League was wrestled away by Real Madrid on Wednesday, who will now take on Bayern Munich for a place in this season's showpiece fixture. After a thrilling 120 minutes in Manchester, Bernardo Silva and Matteo Kovacic both missed from the spot as City, the defending champions, were beaten 4-3 on penalties after their thrilling quarter-final tie ended 4-4 on aggregate. I don't know what to say, it's just frustrating. A bemused Ruben Dias told TNT Sports after the match. We dominated the game, the whole game. Until the penalties, the effort was there. We had our chances, but it's obviously difficult to take. Real Madrid will next take on Bayern Munich, who also defeated English opposition in the shape of Arsenal. Joshua Kimmich's 63rd-minute header was enough to send the Germans through to the semi-finals 3-2 on aggregate after the two teams had drawn 2-2 in London in the first leg. The winner of that two-legged tie will then take on either Paris Saint-Germain or Borussia Dortmund in the Champions League final on June 1 at Wembley. But no Premier League team will contest the final at the home of English football on a pulsating night of European drama. There are always eyebrows raised when Holland is taken off before the game is won, because this was probably the second time it has happened since he arrived at City nearly two years ago. A lot is always made of his contribution when he is not scoring, and unless that verges into wild exaggerations about League Two, there is merit in it. His hold-up play has not been the best of late, but it remains the case that even when he is not actually contributing with touches, he is forcing the opposition to do something they do not want to do. Last week he occupied two Madrid defenders, at the weekend he forced Luton Town to abandon their usual man-to-man -man press. But after the 90 minutes were up here Guardiola elected for something different, the all-action, more-touches style of Julian Alvarez. The Argentina forward did offer more touches but little of substance, with Madrid absolutely packing the middle of the pitch, and he was less likely to win a header than Holland, who won a few, but could not make them count. Haaland, of course, is City's penalty taker.